the restaurant, spoken to everybody, had a drink, and bounced. Did I make the right decision, or is Carlin right on this one in terms of his read? That was a really bad decision by you. Nobody wanted you there. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Chris Canty and Chris Carlin are Canty and Carlin. Don't miss them weekdays on ESPN Radio and on ESPN+. Plus. Series gets underway. So Amo gets a hold of one, and Oklahoma grabs the lead. A former NFL head coach is causing drama in the nation's capital. And then we have a dust up at the Capitol, but well, there's no, nothing burned down. And we're not going to talk about it. We're going to make that a major deal. Another big name golfer joins the LIV series. It's about the money. And if the guys aren't saying it's about the money, then they are either kidding themselves or they think the public is stupid. Plus action from across the diamond. It swung out and hit well to left field and deep. This ball back. This ball's gone. This is Sports Center All Night. If you thought that the Browns were going to have a reaction today after this article, you haven't been paying attention. Here's Jay Reynolds. Sports Center All Night, ESPN Radio, the ESPN app, Sirius XM Channel 80. Will they continue to just plow through with blinders in Cleveland? We shall see. Meanwhile, in Boston, NBA action. Game one of the NBA Finals, huge fourth quarter for the Celtics that pushed them to a win on the road in San Francisco. Game two, huge third quarter for the Warriors as they cruised to the win that earned them a split of the first two games. Game three, in Boston Wednesday, Celtics starting early had a double-digit lead in the first quarter. They led by a dozen at the half. But, as we well know, it's the third quarter for Golden State that's pivotal. Here's Curry off the screen and buries another triple. Barely got squared and hits it again. You can't relax. You simply, he's been the best player in the series. He's got 20 on 8 for 12 shooting and 4 for 6 from 3. Curry takes the outlet, gets across the timeline using a Draymond screen against Horford. Buries a triple and got just enough of the body of Horford. A chance at a four-point play for Stephen Curry. This guy is absolutely ridiculous. Here's Curry into the front court to Porter. Give and go to Curry. Top side three for the lead. Got it. A three-pointer. Their first lead since 2-0. 12 straight for the Warriors. 83-82 lead with three and a half left in the third. Warriors with a run in the third quarter again. But the Celtics would have answers. Pass to Smart off the inbound. A three for the lead. Marcus Smart with 310 to go in the third. That's a monster shot. You had to stop the bleeding. Ends a 12-0 Golden State run. Austin blows the lead, fell behind, grabbed the lead right back, and in the fourth quarter... Pass to the corner. Smart in his pocket. Shoots for three and buries a big one with five minutes to go. Jason Tatum performing like a superstar. Ninth assist for Tatum. Third three for Smart. The lead is 14. And now Smart sends it to Tatum. Drives by Curry. Flips it up with a right hand and in. Another tough one at the rim for Jason Tatum. What do I say, Mark? Go with force. Don't worry about the non-calls. That should have been an N1. This guy's a superstar and doesn't get the whistle. But he doesn't look at the official. He just puts it in the cup and walks to the other end. Can I get an amen? Amen. Celtics withstand the big third quarter run from Golden State. They come away with the win at home in game three. 116-100. Celtics take a 2-1 series lead. They are now 7-0 following a loss this postseason, tied for the most wins following a loss in a single postseason in NBA history. Coach Ime Udoka. You know, it's a long series, and we take it one by one, and, and our focus is on the next game, and we'll look at a bunch of things we could have done better, obviously, in that run in the third quarter, but uh, I don't think at this point there's any anxiety from the players. It is what it is. We've been battle-tested throughout the playoffs, and... Um, this far into a series it should be on to the next and i think we've seen what makes us successful and just have to have carry over after win more so than we have in the past in the playoffs this year celtics had 52 points in the paint 22 second chance points and 15 offensive rebounds jason tatum 26 points six rebounds nine assists in the win 
Our Elise soldiers caught up with them after game three. Jason, you guys knew you had to respond. What was the difference tonight, especially with your defense in the fourth quarter? Uh, just staying with it. We obviously know they're, that's a great team and they're going to go and run. Uh, just how you respond. You know, you know, we know we haven't been doing well, playing well in the third quarter. So that was a point of emphasis coming out, starting the third quarter well, uh, with a lot more pace, and just responding to their runs. Uh,